It's Sunday, my people. It is Sunday. Happy Sunday to each and every one of you. Hoping that wherever you are, that the sun is shining, you're feeling the warmth. I'm here and I'm thankful. <laughs> I am here and I am thankful. I am thankful. It's a new day and we're here to see it. I think, what time is it now? About 12? Eleven thirty-eight, guys. Oh, so the clock up there is correct. Eleven thirty-eight, Sunday morning. I didn't eat yet. Don't know what I'm going to eat. Don't know what I want to eat. And so I am just giving thanks because so many do not have what to eat. They don't even have a choice right today. So I am just here. So today my, my, my video is it's a quick, I'm going to do another video later. I'm going to do a one pot meal, um, which is really just going to be a reflection of years ago you're talking about many many years ago um when our mom came to america we were left home with we were left well i was back and forth from trelawney to saint catherine and our stepfather would get the funds and not use it to do what he needed to do and this is one of the things we used to do we used to cook one pot meals in order to survive so i'm going to quickly bring one back to memory to let you understand that Sometimes these are the things you, you go back to them and you can laugh out loudly about them because you didn't use them to become a crutch not to do well. You didn't use them to become bitter and keep focusing on those bad things and not grow. You, you use them as memories. Like these are some of the things that help to build you, to make you become the strength, the tower of strength that you become later in life. Um, but before we get to that video later, I just wanted to, to give to, to just, this is just for your information and FYI for you, my family. Um, on, on Friday, what happened is that we were here and all of a sudden we heard a sound in this um, AC out here. And then all of a sudden it's like lights were flicking, like, you know, and plugs were not working and the refrigerator was barely, it like, we had to unplug it because we didn't know what happened. If there was a short somewhere, we didn't know what happened. Sister Dawkins made a call. The, the, the electrician was up in Portland um, doing work, wasn't in the area. Um, he said he would have sent someone. That someone is not well, had a stroke. And so it was just interesting. You're talking about it was like 88 to 90 degrees. And so luckily, on the other side where the bedrooms are those those switches were, the, the, the outlets are working and the lights are working and the fans were able to be used and uh, we were here um we, we went through it friday night sabbath morning yesterday we got up and made some they made calls and finally got to somebody who the guy who who the landscaper he came by, he said, um, he came to just check, and then he had somebody who was going to come in, an, a real electrician. So he, I actually asked him for his card, so he left his card with here, so they will have it here. And um, but when he checked, he said, he, he did the tester in the, in the breaker box and realized that the one part of the place was getting le the, 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 the wattage or the whatever that thing is. Um, <laughs> um, you have the wattage and you have the, what do you call it? I don't remember what they call it, but um, it wasn't enough. It was less than a hundred. And so he went outside, he checked the meter box and he did the tester again and said, yeah, um, the house was not getting enough power source. So, he said, they have to get the, the, um, 
light and power people here. And so they called and they did get the appointment and they said between one hour to six hours. And we're like, yeah, six hours, that means it's in the night time. So who's going to be out here with them in the night? But forgetting that they didn't have to come in here, they just need to fix what needed to be fixed on the street, on the post, and get it. But God had it to do when the guy came. We, was, we heard the truck, he would stop at the wrong gate and we called him and he came down. And he, it, he stayed outside, he didn't have to come in. He tested the meter box, I told him what the other guy said, and he tested the meter thing. And yes, one part had 111, I think, um, volts or something like that. And the other one only have 75. So he had to take the long ladder, climb up on the pole. I came in when he climbed up because I said, oh my God, I don't want that the power to hit him. But they're, they're verse, they know their job. So he went up and did what he did. And I, when he came down, I heard him talking. I went back out there and he fixed it. He says it was erosion on the wiring up there. So after he did that, he says, all right, turn on the AC, turn on, the lights turn on the AC when I did but this AC out here didn't come on so I told him and I said it looks like they, when the guy did something in the breaker box that he didn't fix it back and he came in he said can I come in and we said I said yes so we let him in and he came in and he clump, 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 and <laughs> he fixed back the breakers and the light came on the wall the red light that should be there and yeah we got cool here again. So I was just saying that I wanted to share that, not because I want to tell you that we had the, the thing with the, the thing, but to let you know that what we found yesterday, what he, he told us yesterday, last night, was that when you live where the water coming is coming off the ocean, coming at you, it does create erosions. So even the buildings eventually is gonna is gonna go through that because of the salt water so it builds up on stuff it builds up and so that's what was blocking the the voltage the right amount of voltage to come in so just letting you know that those of you with your beautiful homes are by the seaside that that's something to look out for um when things get conked out it's not because you need to replace new things but you want to make sure they check the wiring on the especially us here in jamaica where the, the wires are above ground um, they're not underground. So I just wanted to share that, guys. What we have, we're cool again. Um, last night was awesome. It was just, we had the fans, but the fans doesn't do that powerful job like the AC does. <laughs> and, um, and when you have temperatures like in the 80s, you really need some cool, some cool in air. So that is that, guys. And I just want to take the time out now to just say a big shout out to all of you out there who are doing your channels and and, 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 and is seriously investing your time and effort into it to make it grow because if it grows and, and you, you can get success from it. When I got to 2,000 something, I think 1,000 something, I was getting $100 from YouTube and then it gradually grew to 127 and then it gradually grew not by much to 130 something. But you, you can, if you, I content wise, I don't know. Like down here, maybe you can get more content here in Jamaica. But if you are out there on the grind and you're doing what you have to do, you can make it. You can make it. <laughs> That's a bad That's a door to the washroom. Um, the, breeze, the wind is so nice on the porch. And if you're sitting inside now because the, the wind comes straight up, and how the walls are set, you're not going to get that cool breeze in. But if you're outside, man, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Right. So if, you, if you're willing, guys, and you're one of them who don't mind, even if you, you don't want to show your face, they have faceless videos that are good and, and helpful to people. The people who just post a picture of themselves and they're talking to people, uplifting them, motivating them. People are cooking things. And all you see are their hands and the food they're cooking. So there are many different ways, guys, that you don't have to go on and, and afraid to talk or, you know, you can, you can, you can create 
something, especially as you get older, you want to have. Wow, thank you. Right? You can, um, you can, you can, you can do things that will encourage people. You're making jewelry and, and, and nobody has to see your face. You know, if you're afraid that, you know, you're too fat, you're too skinny, look at me, I'm out here. I, it's what it is. You just have to love yourself and embrace who you are and go talk to the world. You might not reach a million people, but you can reach a hundred. You can reach 3,000 like I have. I'm at 3,600 and something. Who knew? Who ever knew that? And so pick up your cameras, guys. God's creation is beautiful. There's so much out there. So pick it up and go and, and try. And so I, I commend all of you out there trying. Again, those of us with channels, remember, go to each other's channels Go like their videos, go subscribe to their channels, and invite them to come to your channel, and 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 each one helping the other one, right? Um, so I'll just give a shout out again to Bev Brown, who is right here with me. Um, Life with Bev Brown. Go check her out, guys, and help her get to the thousand. She's almost there. She's almost there. This girl put in so much into her channel. She's always on the grind. She's always getting, putting things in. And so I respect her for that. Um, now we have Sister Kay Dawkins. Her channel is Jamaica K Lifestyle. And so she also has IHS Ministries. So she is, this new channel is just basically about everyday stuff, right? Um, please support her, like a video or two or three or more, and just share them. The easiest share is on, is on, the easiest share is on WhatsApp. Just leave a little note as you, as you click the share button from the video. Um, it's going to allow you to write on, in, in, in the, on the video. And right above the link, it's going to have you. Just put a little note, guys, please support this woman. Or just please support my friend. Or please subscribe to this channel and like the video. And just send it out. Just send it out. You can only send to five at a time. But keep on, guys. Just send it. Click, you know, once you get it into WhatsApp, you just click on one of the persons that you sent it to. And just share it. You don't have to type anything again because it's already done. Just click on it and keep sharing it out to all them hundreds of people on your WhatsApp channel. And, and so that we can grow. All right? It's a good thing, guys. You don't have to give money. But little things like this, you can give it. And it makes a difference for someone. And um, Mojo Jojo, she is Little J Plays. Go over there, guys. She's growing. Please go over there and support her. Um, she also does Essence of Mercy and Grace. Again, guys, just like, click the thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to their channel. We have Jet, my friend Jet. She has a, a channel coming too. And it's just Jet Sheely. J-E-T-T-S-H-E-L-E-Y. So support her, guys. It might look like a small beginning, but we never know. Because it just takes one video to shoot off and... And, and make a difference to somebody. Um, oh my God, I can't remember. When I get here, I need to make a list. But please, guys, you always see the people that I'm shouting are trending live TV. Oh my God, my saver. My saver. She gets on and I got over there and on their channel and they come back to my channel and they drop my link, they drop my link, they share out the videos. I'm so thankful to you, Trending. I so respect and appreciate you. Thank you, my friend. Thank you so much. And guys, as she supports me, please go over to Trending Live TV and support her as well. I so truly appreciate the support and the love from both her and Buddha. So support them, guys. And now I just want to give a shout out to my family, my big sister in New York. Blessings, my dear. My brother. I know you're down there in New York this blessed day. Blessings to you and my sister-in-law, Yona, and little Junior. And then we come up to CT, and I say blessings to my two beautiful daughters. 
Um, thank you for your love. Thank you for your support. Oh, my God, my daughters, God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. And then my one son, oh, thank you. Thank you for all that you guys do for your one mother. When well, you call me your mom and your dad, but, <laughs> but thank you for appreciating me, for always saying thank you, mom, for what you have done for us. Never ungrateful. I thank you and I appreciate you for that. Much love to you, Grace and Angie Marie. Sheree, thank you for being a wife and a friend to my son. Thank you. Thank you, my son, for being for treating her with respect and kindness. That's one of the things I needed from you. I didn't care about how much you love her. I wanted the respect attached to that love. And thank you so far. You have done just that. So blessings to all of you guys. I love you. I appreciate you. Jen Jr., my big tall cousin down there in New York. Thank you, my cousin, for all your love and your support. Ernestine, my sister in the UK, along with Lady K. Listen, I saw Lady K, I saw your picture in the Blessings of Kitchen shirt. I love it, I love it, I love it. Thank you for wearing my work. Thank you for promoting it. Thank you for appreciating it. I I, I feel good. And I also want to say, Miss Ruby, thank you so much. Um, I know you in... You're over there. You're not here in Jamaica right now. But much blessings to you, my cousin and friend. AG, thank you for calling. Thank you for touching bases. Thank you for appreciating. Thank you for good conversation. Thank you, my people. And all of you who have brought laughter to my life, who have appreciated me, no matter how, what I look like, no matter how big I am, no matter how whatever. <laughs> thank you for appreciating this girl. Because this girl appreciates all of you. Um... It's not what we look like. It's who is how we treat people. And so I am grateful to God that he has blessed me with the ability to appreciate people for who they are, for where they are. And so life is worth so much because people listen, people talk with, people talk to me, and I truly appreciate it. So make it a great day, my people. I will send another video. So again, you know my videos are mostly listening videos. There's nothing to see there unless you're trying to look at my hair color and say, wow, my hair color looks nice. Or you're looking at my nails and say, oh, I love that blue. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But um, just, just uh, make sure that you listen to them, like them, share them. Um, there might be a word or two in there that will encourage somebody else. Don't be selfish and keep it to yourself. Share it, and hopefully it will be a blessing to someone else. So until later, guys, when the pot is on, is ready to be, to to be to be dealt with, um, I'm gonna say bye. Be good to yourself. Embrace who you are. Love, love, love to all of you, and just goodbye. <laughs>